To find the oxidation number for each element in KBrO4, potassium perbromate, we'll use these rules here. First off, there's no negative or positive sign after the KBrO4. That's because it's a neutral compound. All the oxidation numbers, they add up to zero. We know that potassium here in group one, that'll have a plus one oxidation number. Bromine, normally we think of that as minus one because it's in group 17. But when it's bonded to oxygen or fluorine, it doesn't have that minus one. So we really don't know what it is. Let's call it X. Oxygen, that's almost always minus two. So we know this all equals zero. We can just set an equation up. One plus X, then we have minus two times four, minus eight, that equals zero. X minus seven equals zero. So X needs to equal a plus seven. So the oxidation number on the bromine here in KBrO4, that's going to be plus 7. If we add all these up, 4 times minus 2, that's minus 8, plus 7, that's minus 1, plus 1, that gives us 0. You may have been able to figure this out without doing an equation here. Either way, you get the same answer. This is Dr. V, and thanks for watching.